Hey, what's going on YouTube? I am the Call of Duty Cinema 12 and today I'm bringing you guys a gameplay commentary of Call of Duty, finally. Um, my friend actually let me borrow Black Ops so I was able to get my hands on it and finally play a good Call of Duty because I am sick and tired of Modern Warfare 3. And that's actually what's going to be the topic of today's video is my final thoughts on Modern Warfare 3. So uh, to get things started, I think we all can agree that it is a terrible game. All right, they only did like three things right in the game. Um, I think one of them is the the kill streaks where they can stack. I think that was really good because uh, it really sucked how if you got on a huge kill streak, then you had to die to get those kill streaks back. And I really liked in Modern Warfare 3 how let's say you're using assault like a UAV pred and attack helicopter then you can just keep recycling that and maybe even get a moab with assault if you're really that good so that's why I liked it um, one thing they did bad was uh, support kill streaks. I feel like in the beginning of the game it was just extremely like terrible you'd get stealth bombered like six times in a regular match and because it was just too easy to get, it was only 14 kills. And most people are good enough to get 14 kills. So the stealth bomber didn't get anything, like, it didn't get underpowered at all. They just made it super easy to get. And here comes six stealth bombers. There's six deaths on somebody who's trying to go for a Moab with specialist or whatever. So that kind of sucked. Um, another thing they did right was specialist kill streaks. I thought that Specialist was amazing. Um, it added a lot of diversity and skill. Even though you did have like all these perks, you still had to get eight kills without all those perks to get up um, to the to get up to the Specialist bonus. So I thought that that was really really good. And I thought that like Black Ops 2 is kind of doing a similar thing. So it's like with the pick ten system, you can like pick eight perks or whatever or six perks so I think that's gonna be really fun and I'm probably definitely only gonna use uh, one like assault rifle or whatever and then all those perks because I just love specialists so much I thought it was a great uh, system of how they did it so I thought specialist was definitely a good thing that they did right and uh, one thing they did terrible in Modern Warfare 3 was lag comp like literally every game I went into I would lag to shit and like all these people on the other team are four barring where I'm sitting here two barring and it was just terrible so I think they hopefully they do have a good um, lag comp in Black Ops 2 because that's a huge factor in any F FPS so hopefully that does get changed and everything and then in uh, Modern Warfare 3 obviously the spawns were awful I hope in Black Ops 2 it's not that bad in Black Ops I thought it was really really balanced and getting the game like for like a weekend or whatever uh, I could really see the difference between Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops because Modern Warfare 3 was extremely chaotic whereas Black Ops it wasn't even it was like it was kinda of boring actually because a lot of people would just use Ghost and sit in a corner and if you're on a high kill streak and you run into a room and here's a guy with Ghost camping in the corner you're kinda of screwed and it's really hard to find people that way because UAVs they weren't like a big part in Black Ops because of how overpowered Ghost was so hopefully in Black Ops 2 they change Ghost I already know that if you're moving Ghost works or yeah Ghost works while you're moving so that eliminates the camping factor so I think that's that's a good idea hopefully people won't abuse it but you never know we'll probably find some way to corrupt the game but yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy my analysis of Modern Warfare 3. It was an awful game. Uh, I think everybody in the community can agree with that. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this. Please give it a like and subscribe for more. As always, YouTube, peace.